Kriska is a uh, 550 tractor fleet. Uh, we're based in southern Ontario uh, with the geographic coverage of Ontario and Quebec. Uh, and we're a truckload carrier, um, a truckload cross-border carrier. And most of what we do is we move food for Fortune 100 companies. Uh, we employ about 600 drivers. We have about 750 total associates that work here. Our average length of haul is under 500 miles. So most of what we do would be considered an overnight trip to either uh, the Midwest, so Chicagoland area, or to central Pennsylvania. Uh, in terms of the type of trucks that we spec, 80% um, of what we spec are highway trucks or bunk trucks, uh, and the remaining 20% would be day cabs that would use uh, in the Montreal or Toronto markets to load and stage freight for the highway trucks. Today, Crisca's fleet is a predominantly international product. We're about 98% international, uh, and we have been trending up and up over the years to get close to the 100%. So what we've done over the past couple of years in terms of specking is we've turned over that responsibility to the engineering team at International. So that process is a pretty neat process for us where we bring in uh, the engineers from International uh, and we tell them, here's the work our trucks are going to do. Uh, our trucks have to be spec for comfort, so we need an APU and we need a refrigerator and an automatic transmission for our drivers. But other than that, um, we allow engineers uh, at International to tell us what's the best spec for our truck. So whether that's uh, aero kits, gear ratios, uh, tires, transmissions, engines, we leave that all up to them. So over the past couple of years, we've experimented with International uh, on things like 56-inch bunks, um, aluminum wheels, electric APUs, changing components to lightweight plastics, uh, horizontal exhausts, super single tires. Uh, anything that we can do to shave a pound or two off our trucks we've been doing. And again, that's something we rely heavily on the, the uh, engineering team at International to help us with. So in our application, most of what we spec is a ProStar ES highway truck. Uh, that's the majority of the trucks that we purchase. Uh, we have a smaller number of ProStar day cabs. So over the last two years, we've moved almost exclusively towards uh, International's N13 engine. Uh, we're very pleased with the initial results we've seen from that engine around fuel economy. And one of the biggest reasons that we've decided to move down that path is around weight. It's one of the lightest commercial engines available in the marketplace, which is really important for our customers so we can haul more freight. From a technical standpoint, the reliability and the uptime that we're seeing on these new engines is fantastic. In our business, you know, 10, uh, 10 miles per gallon is the holy grail. Uh, in today's environment and we're very pleased that our 2015 and 2016 ProStar ESs are achieving that mark. You know, we want to hire a driver at Crisca, uh, give him or her a great working environment and make sure they get home safely and uh, we're very fortunate to have uh, a strong team at International who supports us in that mandate. So whether it's forward-looking radar, um, collision mitigation systems that they can spec on their trucks, uh, advanced braking technologies, roll stability, um, you name it. International really brings us um, braking technologies within the safety space. Uh, the on-command program from uh, International is probably um, the most influential piece of telematics that we've seen in our industry um, ever. And so if you think about the cost to the organization of having a truck on the side of the road, it's enormous. There's the cost of having to pay the driver to wait, there's the cost of failing the customer, there's the cost of recovering the load. If we can eliminate or reduce those costs by um, deferring non-essential maintenance items to when we have a truck back in one of our terminals, it's a huge win to the organization. If you think of a trucking company, we don't have factories, we don't, we don't make widgets. Um, the big piece of equipment that we have are tractors and you know at Crisco we have 550 tractors so the importance of having those trucks being uh, the best trucks that our money can buy uh, is incredible to us uh, it's consequential to us and the senior leadership team uh, at International has been um, easy to get a hold of uh, collaborative with us um, they help us out when we need help um, and we couldn't imagine a better partner for our business